How's it going, the James Yonder Outdoors? Well, I've got an order of uh, Kentucky Hornstone in. And it has some thick cortex. Yeah, I've never seen anything like that. Look at that. That's not even the bad one. Look at that. All the white is cortex. So, what I'm going to be doing today is just bifacing. Just getting stuff ready to nap. I'm going to be using a uh, quartzite hammerstone. It's actually a little bit softer than what I would normally call quartzite. I'm pretty sure that's what this is. It's actually a little bit too light for this. The only other heavy one, it heavier one, that is uh, a quartzite hammerstone, but it's a lot harder and it doesn't work as well on this stuff. So I have to settle for this, but it shouldn't be too bad. Now this chalk, this quartz side is all chalk, is uh, very dusty so I've got a ceiling fan on and I've got another fan blowing crossway so there's probably going to be a bit of noise on this video so I hope that doesn't bother you. Where am I going to get started? I think right here. I'm just going to use this hammer stone as a punch most of the time.
think that's good enough for now. Oh, Boy, this one's gonna be tough. I'm really not used to these rounded cobbles like this. Usually, <clears throat> usually hitting on square edges. This round stuff kind of messing with me a little bit. Figured that'd be a bad spot. Well, I broke that one. Got some crystal in it right there. That spot went pretty deep. Who will? Probably wouldn't have got anything out of that anyway.
And if you're wondering if me hitting my leg like that hurts, yes it does. And if you're wondering why I'm still doing it, because I'm dumb. That's the only explanation I have, because I'm dumb. I'm not really caring for this stuff. I think I'll buy Hornstone again. Unless I can find it with a bit thinner Cortex. I think there's only one or two pieces in the whole box that had thin Cortex. This chalk it absor absorbs the the blow of the hammer stone, and it just does not want to release all that easy. That's why it's breaking like that. This end's already buggered up. Maybe. I don't think I'm going to be able to get anything out of that piece anyway, it's so dang, dang thin. This one might be a lost cause. The rock itself is not bad. This is dang cortex. Uh -uh. Yeah, I'm definitely not going to buy this stuff again. I've never had a problem with this. And the reason I couldn't shoot it that way is all this was cracked from 
when they spalled it out. So, I guess that'll conclude this video. Maybe I can get something out of this stuff. Got one pretty good piece. It has some of the discoloration right there. I don't know how that's going to work out, but we'll see. See you on the next one. Bye.